Hi, welcome to the YouTube channel of Microtronics Technologies. And right now I'm going to give you the demonstration of the project IoT based smoke detector system. To send the data to IoT, there are various uh, websites available on the internet. Uh, as of now, we, can, we have used thingspeak.com uh, website. So here you can see the graph uh, of the sensor values. So whatever data you send to IoT, it is shown in the form of graph. So in this project, we have used this MQ series uh, smoke sensor. The output of smoke sensor is in analog format that is given to the Arduino Uno. So this is the Arduino Uno. And here uh, the LCD display will show the percentage of smoke. Now I will give you the demonstration of the project. Before starting the demonstration, I have uh, cleared the channel. So you can see there are no records. So now once the data is sent from the project, it will be shown here within few seconds. Whenever you turn on the project, the Arduino will wait for this for the network to be received uh, on the GSM modem. Now you can see the blinking speed of this network LED is reduced. Then the Arduino will send the SMS to the registered mobile number. It says SMS sent successfully. Now you can see SMS is received over here. So it just displays the project title IoT based smoke monitoring system. After that, it will initialize the GPRS and the GSM and it will display the sensor value. Arduino will display uh, the sensor value after every two seconds and after a particular time interval, it will send the data to IoT. Now you can see the data is sending uh, to the IoT. Now the first data was sent from the uh, project was 5. So you can see here the value 5 is shown on the IoT website. Now I will give you the demonstration with the smoke. Please be very careful while giving the demonstration with the smoke. So you can hold the sensor upwards down. Now you can see the value of smoke will increase and this increased value is sent to the IoT. The second data sent from the project was 4. So within couple of seconds, uh, the data will be reflected here. Now you can see the first value was 5 uh, and the second value is 4. One more feature is given in this project that is whenever the value crosses the threshold level it will send SMS to the registered mobile number. So now you can see the SMS is received smoke 36% smoke sensor crossed threshold level. Let's uh, take few samples. Now the value is somewhere around 10 to 12 percent and this data is now sent to the IoT. The fourth value sent from the uh, project was 9 percent so it will be reflected here. So you can see here the fourth value is logged and it is shown so various values shown here are 5, 4, 1 and 9. So this way you can use this IoT website so to see the historical data. Historical data will be shown here in the form of graph. Also it provides an option to export the data in the form of Excel that is the CSV, JSON or XML. So let's export it in the form of CSV. Here the data is uh, uh, exported in the form of CSV. Now here you will see uh, the time at which the data was a lock to the IoT. Uh, this is the serial number and these are the various values of the smoke at that particular time. So that was about the demonstration with the smoke. Now I will give you the overview of various components in the circuit. So this is the uh, this, this, this is the main PCB and this is the power supply part. Here we have given the input supply of 12 volt DC adapter. Uh, you can use 
ट्वेल्व वोल्ट ए सी एडेप्टर ट्वेल्व वोल्ट डी सी एडेप्टर और ट्वेल्व वोल्ट ट्रांसफॉर्मर इवन यू कैन गिव द पावर सप्लाई यूजिंग अ ट्वेल्व वोल्ट डी सी बैटरी सो दिस दिस सप्लाई इज कनेक्टेड टू अ ब्रिज रेक्टिफायर आफ्टर दैट अ फिल्टर कैपेसिटर एंड दीज आर दोल्टेज रेगुलेटर दिस इज सेवन एट जीरो फाइव एंड सेवन एट वन टू दिस सेवन एट जीरो फाइव जनरेट फाइव वोल्ट इट इज गिवन टू दी एल सी डी डिस्प्ले द आर डी नो एंड द सेवन एट वन टू सप्लाई इज गिवन टू दी बजर एंड द रीले दीज आर दी पावर सप्लाई इंडिकेशन एल ईडीज जस्ट टू इंडिकेट दैट दी ट्वेल्व वोल्ट एंड फाइव वोल्ट वोल्टेज इज जनरेटेड सक्सेसफुली दिस इज द रीले दिस इज गिवन एज दैन एडिशनल फीचर इन द सर्किट यू कैन कनेक्ट एनी आउटपुट डिवाइस ए सी और डी सी आउटपुट डिवाइस टू दिस रीले सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू कैन कनेक्ट अ फैन Uh, so whenever the smoke is turned on the relay will be turned on and it will turn on the fan this buzzer is for the indication that the smoke has crossed the threshold level now this is the gsm modem here as i said you have to insert a sim card over here uh, the power supply to this gsm modem is given from this uh, main circuit this gsm modem is connected to the main circuit using uh, these three wires that is receiver transmitter and the ground pin RXD, TXD, and GND pin. It is given here. Then uh, this is the GSM uh, modem antenna. Uh, to be specific, we have used SIM 900 uh, GSM modem. Then this is the Arduino Uno board. It is connected uh, using this data bus. Uh, the pin number zero to pin number eleven is connected to this main PCB. This is the 16 by 2 alpha numeric display. Uh, this is potentiometer. This potentiometer is used to vary the contrast voltage of uh, LCD. And uh, from this main PCB, we have given power supply to this uh, Arduino Uno board. Also, uh, the analog input pin is connected to the sensor. And this is the smoke sensor. please note that this smoke sensor has two output pins uh, one is analog output and second is digital output out of this two we have used uh, analog output the reason is we have to show the percentage of the smoke on lcd so that can be done only using the analog output pin that's all about the demonstration of the project iot based smoke detector circuit using arduino uno thank you